Platelet rich plasma therapy is when blood is withdrawn normally from your arm and put in a centrifuge or spun in a centrifuge in order to separate the plasma from the platelets. The platelets are then removed and then injected into the scalp or the skin. The platelets themselves have got lots of growth factors which promote the growth of collagen, new blood vessels and the repair of nerves. It also helps hair follicles become more healthy and grow healthier, thicker hair. Platelet-rich plasma can be used in many specialities including dermatology, dentistry and orthopedics and can be used in skin diseases such as alopecia areata where people, patients lose their hair as a result of their own immune system attacking their hair and platelet-rich plasma can be very useful in such skin diseases. Platelet-rich plasma is required in order to make the skin look more beautiful or younger or the hair look a lot thicker and healthier. We also use platelet-rich plasma in certain skin diseases such as alopecia areata which is a condition where one loses one's hair on the scalp and face and sometimes body. We also use it in burns and also in leg ulcers and other specialities such as dentistry and orthopedics use it as well. The ideal candidate for platelet-rich plasma is someone who does not want anything too invasive. Platelet-rich plasma therapy makes your own body create the collagen, so you can't create too much collagen and overcompensate. For instance, like a filler can make your lips look outsized. Platelet-rich plasma won't do that. It'll just stimulate your own body to make the collagen. The main conditions we use platelet-rich plasma is for rejuvenation of the skin, making it look younger, reducing wrinkles, reducing fine lines. We also use it on the scalp to make the hair look healthier and thicker. We can also use it in certain medical conditions such as alopecia areata, where patients can use their scalp, facial and body hair. We can also use it in leg ulcers, burns and in the condition called melasma. Melasma is a condition where you get increased pigmentation on the forehead, cheeks and chin and platelet-rich plasma can be one of the many ways that can help treat this condition. The main potential risk factors are very uncommon but like all treatments there is some risk. The main risk would be the transfer of infection but the system itself is closed and is never in touch with the air the blood is taken in a sterile fashion and transferred to the centrifuge in a sterile fashion. It is then injected into the skin after sterilizing the skin. And the other potential side effect though would be potentially if one damaged a vein or a blood vessel causing bruising and swelling. But that's very reversible and it tends to reverse between seven and 10 days at the most. But I must emphasize that these are very uncommon